we have hundreds of thousands of visits to our location every year. Um, so it's, it's really sad that a, a small group of folks are willing to, to dissolve the library, shut it down completely, rather than let families make their own choices about what, they're, what they want to read. That small group will now, well, they now know when it will take its next step toward a possible dissolution of the Meridian Library District. A hearing date has been set for March 20th at 6 p.m. That is when the public will be able to give their thoughts on the Meridian Library. That hearing will be held on the first floor of the Ada County Courthouse. At the center of this hearing, a petition filed by a group who calls themselves the Concerned Citizens of Meridian. They accuse the Meridian Library District of allowing books and other materials on their shelves targeted towards sexualizing minors, claiming they are contributing to the sexual indoctrination of minors. They also claim the library district board members refuse to discuss this policy on the topic and has shut down conversations about it at open meetings. If you would like to contribute to this conversation, to dissolve or not to dissolve, the Ada County Commissioners would like to hear from you, but only if you live within the Meridian Library District. And if you don't know, Check out this map. The Meridian Library District borders are no on the north side, McDermott Road, part of West Lake Hazel Road, the Boise River, and as you can kind of see on the east side, it gets a little bit more complicated, but you kind of get the point of where that might be. So if you live within those parameters, they want to hear from you. This would be step two in the process, by the way, to eliminate Meridian Libraries. Turning in the petition to step one, after this hearing, Commissioners will decide if they want to let Meridian voters decide to dissolve or not to dissolve. And if it comes to that and the majority vote to dissolve the library district, it all goes away. It's worth pointing that out. State law says they have to sell off everything, not just the books, but the shelves on which they sit, the tables and the chairs on which you sit. Speaking of chairs, if you'd like one for the March 20th hearing, you might want to show up early.